Jeeves, fetch me my finest racing shoes. I fancy a run around the paddock, and I fancy it now. Rolls-Royce is an icon of luxury, effortless elegance, and timeless beauty. For over 100 years, Rolls-Royce has built aircraft engines, armored cars, and handcrafted luxury automobiles. With a precedent of the highest quality, building each car requires hundreds of hours of craftsmanship. Today, the classic Spirit of Ecstasy hood ornament adorns the Wraith the most powerful and technologically advanced Rolls-Royce ever produced. Power is supplied by a 6.6-liter twin turbocharged V12 engine, while the signature Magic Carpet Ride is maintained by an electronically controlled air suspension. The Wraith's innovation harkens back to the words of co-founder Sir Henry Royce, take the best that exists and make it better. When it does not exist, design it. What's happening everybody, the transporter here and today we're in for quite a lovely surprise. This is the first time a Rolls Royce has been featured in any racing game and what better racing game for it to be featured in than Forza of all things. <sighs> I don't have anything against Forza, I mean they are different but I'm a GT person. Well, I am a GT person but I'll give Forza a try for now but I'll admit they do a fantastic job bringing real cars to this virtual uh, virtual realistic uh, whatever virtual world that they that they've designed here and this this has been meticulously done from front to finish so let's take a look at it now briefly uh, we've already seen the um, the uh, auto vista there's the flying maiden there the engine uh, lovely lights here. We don't need to talk about that. Wheels got 20 inches. Scissor doors here. Look at them. Yes, you are a big shot. Right now, G's was to step in. This is the passenger door. Imagine if this car was in Forza Horizon 2. I just take it on long drives. Just now, I have a care in the world. Oh, look at the clock. Oh, they have a thing for that too. Ready. Lovely doors. Look at that interior. It's only like small polygons there, but for mo for the most part, this has been well done. Look at that. Shift type. It's a button. I see no paddle shifts on the thing. There are eight gears. I have no idea how fast this goes, but we'll find out soon enough. Uh, let's see. Okay, out the door. If I can, if I can get out, can I get out? Oh, da 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 da. Oh well, close the door. Those are the rims. Don't need to look about those. Got all this trunk space. Hmm. I could fit the goat in there. Two goats. Two goats. A uh, meerkat and a squirrel. Uh, don't need to look at that. Man. Oh yeah, I've driven this car already. I won gold medal. Anyway, oh well. But uh, anyway, on the door. This is the this is the main office here. Now let's step in. We close the door. And we turn on the engine. Oh wait, no, that's the dashboard. Okay, that's the dashboard. Now we turn on the engine. Listen to this. You can barely hear it! It's brilliant about Rose Royce. They aren't shouted, they're just very, very nice. In the words of Jason May, they're very nice. Very nice throws. Barely hear it. It's just about taking taking people in sumptuous luxury. 
for more than you can afford. And above uh, above all this, the car itself is uh, rather beautiful. So I can step out here. Step out here. Close the door. And just admire the thing. Ready? There it is. The lights are still on. Anyway, just admire it. Look at that. Because the ghost was already a good looking thing. Now they have the wraith here. Look at this. Which is simply fantastic. Everything has been done right well now. Okay, now. You've seen all there is to see mostly. Hold on. Anything else to see? But we can check out the rims, I guess. Those should be 20s if I'm sure. Are they 20s? I think they're 20s. Yeah, uh, measurements would be good, please. Thank you. 20, oh, 21 inches in the front and the rear. Okay, never mind. Those are big, though. And those are the four, there are four exhausts hiding there. You see, I can, if I can, uh, well, you can't see it here, but there are four exhausts hiding in there. That, uh, make up the thing. Now, now, for more background, uh, the car uses the same chassis as the BMW 7. It just managed to shorten it so that it could so it could actually spawn a BMW 8. Some rum some rumors have been floating around the uh, BMW bus that the Wraith could spawn the BMW 8 series, but that's yet to be decided. But for now, this is as much of a BMW 8 series that you're going to get for about four hundred thousand dollars. So, we need to check out the car now. It's time to give it, take it full spin. Here we are. The Silverson brought the car to Silverson. No upgrades yet. Completely stuck. Still got 624 horsepower underneath that large bonnet. Let's give it a whirl. Oh, dearie me. Oh my god! It's heavy! Very heavy, but these tires are good! Just be me. That's probably just me. Okay, that was actually a good turn, but I floored it. That was stupid. Understeer! There's the understeer it is. The most part. Wow! You can tell that it's the soft, cushy ride. This, this just feels like. I mean, it grips, but it's just very soft and uh, there's just no nonsense. Okay, through here now. Okay, that's actually pretty... Oh, grab the corner, grab the corner. Okay, that's actually pretty slow. There we go. Very good. Very good, very good. Oh, I think I break late in there. Ah, I break late in there. Was not paying attention. Do that again. I was not paying attention. This two ton slab. Oh dear. Okay, through here then. Through there. Keep it in gear three, if I can. I can. I can. Yes. This is beyond eerie. Rolls Royces can't race. Or if I have been, have I lived on a rock for a while? I think I might be taking this too slow. It could just be me. I'm taking this thing way too slow. Okay, I've definitely missed that one. Ew! No brake markers there, so I didn't know where to go. But seriously, like, I love servers then. Okay, lap two, see if I can fix that one blunder there. 
Keep it in gear four. Balance out the throttle there. Oh, break in. Oh, careful, careful. Heavy on the braking. Okay, that was actually a pretty terrible turn. There you go. Oh! It's very subtle, this thing. Oh, there it is. One twenty, one thirty, break. Crab here, good. Break here, gear two. Wanted to keep it in gear three, but oh well. Oh yes, yes, yes. Swing it wide, yes. <laughs> so fun. Oh my god. This thing is phenomenal. Break in. Gear four. Okay, I'm taking it way too slow. Don't get outside. Don't go outside. Do not go outside. Oh, come on. Okay. Okay. Ew, that's actually a pretty terrible turn. Cue it in! Cue it in! Oh, dearie me, that's terrible. Alright, looks like Let's look at the interior. I like that view. Get the flying maid in there. Okay, why am I drifting in there? Yes! <laughs> oh my god! Oh, come on! Damn it! Terrible. Okay, one more if I... Oh, come on! Okay, one more. Actually, two more. I have to fix that turn. What the hell? Ugh. Heavy under brake. Heavy under steer there. All that weight's in the front. Not a lot of it in the back. That's why the thing's a bit tail happy there, but most of the weight here is actually pretty much in the front of that big engine. Yeah. I rolled 30! She's 30! Oh, lock up, lock up, what am I doing? Okay, I actually counter steered there, but oh well. Whoa! This thing is actually pretty, really weird, really weird. I can't believe I missed that one. Okay, I have to go through there. Keep it good, keep it in three. There you go. Look at that. I think I'm just too subtle. I'm not I'm not a I'm not a tire I'm not um I am a lead foot, but I like to be precise this is why I'm actually digging this car. Break it easily there. Come on. I have to master this one. Oh! Lead foot! Lost it. Keep messing this corner up. <laughs> I don't like that corner. 
Yes, cool. <laughs> okay, now, Queen Slate. This is your final chance to get that last corner right. What did I go gear three? Ew. Okay. Break in. Very good. Very good. Very good, very good. <sighs> I can't get tired of this. I don't know why. Okay. It's kind of early breaking there, but no matter. Set me up for a good position in there. Go around, clip it again. Oh, just drift around there. Ah, oh, that's actually pretty terrible. Oh, the wheel spin. That's a pretty terrible corner. Oh well. Keep it upright. Break. Okay. Oh dear. There we go. Yes. Yes, 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 this is brilliant. Don't ruin it. Oh dear. Okay, that's actually pretty slow. That's pretty slow too. I guess I know oh, oh, the suspension and the and the weight actually help keep this car maintained um balanced on the on the road. That's why I'm not really drifting a lot maintaining control in these corners but this thing is heavy god almighty okay I got off there all right now break now there you go look at that look at that yes keep it balanced Yes, very good. Oh, flying lap. I think we can call it there for there. Wow. Oh my goodness, you are one wild car. I gotta see how you are tuned. This thing is just too way too heavy, but uh, just maintains the balance even through the even through the corners. Well, actually, that's kind of no surprise with it because it did take this car to the Nurburgring. But in order to see if that um, Comfort really uh, uh, did a damper on the ride, I just I think he just did take this car to James May because he's the the ride critic. But uh, that's for a later date. Now I gotta wash this car up and tune it up. Right, so let's give it the maximum wattage. Well, what should we put in there? Is it engine conversion? Is it driver train swap? All wheel drive. No! I want those rear wheels spinning. Electric conversion, let's see. Let's give it the max. I'm just gonna just go for max right now. Max, 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 max. Brax, Brax, Brax! What am I doing? What am I doing? Okay. Just gonna give it the maximum race exhaust. Because I'm that much of a ricer and I really don't care what these stuff do. I don't know is that power goes up. Look at it, 748. 748. Race bounds, 757. Engine swap. Engine whatever it is the engine displacement it's a b-class already pistons turbos oh dearie me 889 come on push 1000 push 1000 push this is where grand Prismo comes in handy because then you just put give it an oil change it has like 1000 horsepower there's no such thing as an oil change in forza Rubbish is that?
But the good thing is that stuff here is much cheaper. Yeah, regular. Ready regular and then what are those? Carbon ceramic. Those small brakes actually stop this big old float stop this big old floating boat. Theory heaven, look at that! Can I like oh here we go. Ready? Stock. Boom, boom. Look at this! It's low to the freaking floor. I'm not changing those rims, I'm sorry. Actually, this, or that, this, that, this, that. Oh god, this is so juicy! Um, maybe this, that, this, this, nope, that, this, this. How do we acceleration this decrease in those orders to launch? This! Are you dearing me? I can always change that, alright? But the arches are sticking out now. Front anti roll bar. Give it the handle welding now. Rear anti anti roll bar. Chassis reinforcement. No racing chassis. This is a rolls. This is a rolls. I'm just gonna do that. It's heavier, but forget it. Bumper beams, all interior trim and carpeting. Because we don't need it! Drive train. Race clutch. I think as much, I think, I don't know. It could just be me. Race transmission. This thing is capable of doing over 200. Race drive line. Race diff. A631. This thing is so damn heavy. Your grip. Sport. Race. Drag. Race. Those are racing slicks. Sport. Those are racing slicks and they look so weird. Front tire width. Only by one, because I need to preserve the beauty of this thing. Rear tire width. There. That's it enough. No room style. Staying the same. What could they possibly ew, cannons? You don't put Canards or ring on a rolls. Doesn't work. Alright, I think I did what I could for there. Right, so I've tuned up the big bad rolls here. I haven't really tweak the actual settings, but let's give her a whirl. Let's see if I can get this one lap in. If anything, I think those brakes do help. They really don't really make that much of a difference from those. Uh, actually, they make actually do they do make a bit of difference, but from the uh, those big pistons, those big um, steel metal brakes, stock brakes from the road from the standard rolls. It's a bit more agile. This is phenomenal. Look at that. 170. There you go. Very good, very good. This car is much more agile.
But gear stops is a, are a bit off. Wheel spin does get annoying, but. Just get through here at like gear 3 or gear 4. Ah! Terrible! Why didn't I catch that? There we go. Damn it, I didn't catch that one. Ah! Oh well. Let's keep it going, we're doing good. That's good. Okay, this brakes I do. This brakes do work. This brakes do work wonders. All right, one more. Woo! Oh, too much. Brakes do work wonders. Ah, well. <sighs> All right. Let's see if we can make this one. I will do one more lap. Gear three. Okay, that's a terrible turn. Still safe, sort of. I don't even know. Okay, I'm either being too dainty or just really noobish. Come on! Give me my tail wag. Just the note that bit. It's kind of weird. Let's see, am I in the clear? If I'm not, then I'm gonna stop. victory lap here. Come on. Yes. Push through. That's kind of slow. It's kind of slow as well. Slow. Ew. 
I went off that one. That's not good. Terrible cornering there. Why am I being too dainty? Makes work wonders. Look at those. All righty. That's kind of tough. But that's how pretty much that's how the Rolls Royce uh, race gets around the spa Frank or times without me speaking because I've. Whenever I drive seriously, I tend not to talk, but uh, when, I, when I do talk, I get distracted and all that bit there, but God, this thing is so gorgeous. Look at it. Ah, well, uh, there you have it. I hope you enjoyed this uh, montage of, um, what is it? Mon that's, uh, not even a montage, this compilation of... Uh, Weird, weird shenanigans you can do when the Rolls Royce race. Until then, rate, comment, and subscribe, and I shall see you later. Burnout! <laughs> <laughs>